Today, fourth grade welcomes you to our President's Day presentation. On Monday, February 20th, America will be celebrating George Washington's birthday. So that means no school on Monday. Do you know what it takes to be a president? Well, let's watch this short video to find out more about being a president. In 1787, our country's founding fathers wrote and signed the United States Constitution. This document sets the plan for the U.S. government. It's the law of the land. Section 2 of the Constitution explains who can be president. There are three rules. First, a person must be at least 35 years old. Second, a person must be a natural-born citizen. That means the person must have been born in the United States. If the person is born outside the United States, at least one parent must be a U.S. citizen. Third, a person must have lived in the U.S. for at least 14 years. George Washington was the first president of the United States. He is referred to as the father of our country. Born in Virginia on February 22, 1732, Washington was 57 years old when he was sworn in as president on April 30, 1789. Each year, on the third Monday in February, Americans honor George Washington on President's Day. The holiday also honors Abraham Lincoln. He was the 16th president of the United States. When you grow up, would you like to be president? What kind of leader would you be? Really? President. <laughs> Here's a trivia question for you. How many president how many US states are named after a president? Xander? One? Constitution. And also, I love to read. 
Hi, I'm James Madison, the fourth president. Did you know that he was the shortest president, and in fact he was 5'4", and that's about the height of the school. <laughs> and did you know that James Madison got to the war, and the people that we fought tried to get revenge on us and tried to burn down the White House? Hi, my name is James Bondo. I am the fifth president. The fact I'm thank I was invited to a French ball on my birthday. Here's another thing. I was good friends with Thomas Jefferson. <laughs> I am James Polk, and I was the 11th president of the United States. I was born November 2nd, 1795, in Mecklenburg County, North Carolina. Thumbs up if you have a nickname. Hands down. Well, guess what? James Polk's nickname was Young Hickory. Hi, I'm Abraham Lincoln. I was the 16th president of the United States. When I was 16 years old, I was a professional wrestler. I keep very important documents in my hat. Hi, I'm Ulysses S. Grant. Did you know that the S in my name doesn't stand for anything? Also, my real name is Hiram Ulysses Grant. Hi, my name is Chester A. Arthur, and I am the 21st president. Did you know that I have the exact same birthday as Elio Hayden's dog, except in 1829? <laughs> and Chester, and I wasn't really elected president because I was James Garfield's vice president, who was assassinated. Hi, I'm Grover Cleveland. My real name was Stephen, not Grover. He was the only president to be a teacher for blind people in Manhattan. Hi, my name is Benjamin Harrison. I was the 23rd president of the United States of America. Did you know Benjamin Harrison had two nicknames? They were Iceberg and Cable. Did you know before Benjamin Harrison was elected, he worked as a warrior? Hi, I'm Grover Cleveland again. <laughs> he weighed 250 pounds. He was the sec second heaviest president in the United States. That is 170 more pounds than me. Hi, my name is William McKinley. I'm the 25th president of the United States. Did you know that my wife hated yellow so much that there was no yellow in the White House when I served? Also, did you know that I had a pet parrot that could whistle Yankee Doodle? <laughs>
I'm Harry S. Truman, the 33rd president. Do you, does anyone here have a middle name? Hands up. Okay, hands down. Well, the S in Harry S. Truman doesn't stand for anything. Harry S. Truman said many famous quotes, like when a friend in Washington get a dog and he can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. Hi, I'm Dwight V. Eisenhower, and I was the 34th president. Did you know that I was the first president to ever ride in a helicopter? Also, did you know that my favorite food was my wife's recipe of chocolate fudge? Hi, I'm Richard Nixon, and I was the 37th president. Did you know that I wrote 11 books in my lifetime? You can tell by the books over there. Also, I was the first president to travel to all 50 states, all 50 of them. I was also the first president to resign the office. Hi, I'm Gerald R. Ford. Gerald Ford was commonly known as Jerry and always signed his name Jerry Ford. Gerald Ford was said to, said to have a quote to life. Tell the truth, work hard, and come to dinner on time. Hi. I'm Ronald Reagan, the 40th president of the United States. In high school, I was the captain of the swim team, the yearbook editor, the president of the student body, a member of the football team, a member of the track team, and a member of the basketball cheerleading squad. <laughs> During my presidency, I made the economy grow. This is called Reaganomics, by spending less money, making new businesses, and making new jobs. Hi, my president is George H.W. Bush. He, he was the 41st president of the United States. He served one presidential term from 1989 to 1993. Here's a fun fact about George H.W. Bush. For his 80th, 85th, and 90th birthday, he went skydiving. That's pretty old for going skydiving. <laughs> he also did the coin toss of Super Bowl L.I. Here's another fact for George H.W. Bush. Thumbs up if you like broccoli. He Hands hates down. He hates well, George H.W. Bush hates broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Bill Clinton. I was the 42nd president of the United States. A fun fact about me is that, is that, um, is, so that when I was a child, my nickname was Bubba. <laughs> Another interesting fact about me is that I met my wife Hillary Clinton at Yale University. Hi, my name is George W. Bush, and I was the 43rd president. Did you know that I was the first president to finish a marathon? I finished the marathon in three hours and 44 minutes. Did you know that I was one of four presidents who had been cheerleaders at their schools? Hi, I'm Barack Obama. I was the 44th president. Raise your hand if you go to watch to Baskin Robbins. Well, Obama used to work there. Did you know Obama was a big fan of basketball? He even had a poster of Julius Irving in his bedroom. Hi, I am Donald Trump, the current and 45th president. I am one of the wealthiest 500 billionaires. I was a TV star too. <laughs> Fourth grade is ready to raise the roof by demonstrating our four real rapping skills. This year, we are going to change the original 44 presidents rap to 45 presidents. Can you tell me why, Robert Hirsch? Yo, 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 I think it's because we had to dump number 44 to make way for number 45, Donald J. Trump. Thank you. Let's go for three. Like his father before. 
the White House now.